Hey guys, what's going on? Today I will be showcasing the plugin titled Advanced Mod Request by Super Ronin Craft, which is a great way for players to report issues on your server when there are no staff members online. This plugin is compatible with Minecraft versions 1.8 and above, and it is completely customizable. So the base command for this plugin is going to be slash mod rec or advanced mod rec. And pretty much when we type this in, here is the help menu that we are presented with. First command that I'd like to showcase is going to be the create command, as I think that is the most user friendly command. So we do mod rec create followed by the message. And we can say something like help someone grieved a block in my base. So this is what a player would say towards staff members if uh, no one's online or if they just want to make a report of something that happened. So here we have three categories, so you can of course add more. There's grief, cheater, and hacker. Um, so this falls in line with a grief. Here you can rate the importance of the incident that happened. So diamond or five X's is top importance and one star is of low importance. So we can go ahead and set this to one level importance. And as you guys can see as well, our good buddy, the Stone07, made a ticket and it is flagged as ticket number five with an importance level of five X's. So let's see what this guy is complaining about. What I really like about this plugin is that most commands can actually be accomplished through the GUI menu. So if you look here, we can actually view all active tickets right here. So here we have a new one made by the stone 07. So we can go ahead and click on this ticket. And here we can do stuff like change the importance of his report. We could also just view info on it. Here we can um, click to view the full message. We could return to the ticket list. We can claim this ticket. Claiming is pretty nice. This just lets other staff on the server know that you're you've claimed this ticket and you're the one that's going to handle it. You can also um, flag or unflag tickets. Um, this could be if there's an issue or something or if you want to look back at it later. You can also close the ticket, um, type a reply, and also teleport to the user. So let's teleport to this guy and see what's going on. Okay, so clearly he has been griefed and in his ticket you know he says that he has been griefed as well so we can go ahead and just clean this up a little bit you know i'm not a professional uh, server builder or even an admin or anything yes his house is griefed it's gone to nothing but i think i did a pretty good job at helping him and of course after a job well done i like to you know close the ticket it's quite satisfying to let everyone know that i've helped him out so we can go click to manage the ticket so again it's closed right now we can close it back up and we can also go ahead and reply to the stone the grief is all fixed up enjoy smiley face and our reply was submitted to ticket number five just for him to be nice another thing that you can do in mod request list is you can set a filter so you can actually filter by flagged claimed open closed rating and importance and you can also clear the filters at any time as well so if you only wanted to view open filters as you guys can see there's one posted by the stone one made by me and um, another one posted by me as well okay so from a user side perspective our ticket number two was closed by the stone 07 and a reply has been posted on our ticket so to view your status you could just do mod rec status and you could also specify a username at the end of that to view the status of specific users so we have a ticket here and we got to set the filter to closed as well and as you guys can see we have we have two open and it says i got him don't worry we can click to view the full reply and so he closed the ticket for us and also left a message letting us know that he fixed the issue in proper staff conduct. If the requests begin to pile up to become too much, you could simply run the command modrec purge 
and you can actually purge all closed tickets by just typing in close and two tickets have been purged so these are completely cleared from the system as well i wouldn't recommend doing it to open tickets unless you have a lot of really really old open tickets uh, just to not ignore your uh, player base or anything like that you could also run the command modrec settings and what's really cool about this is it actually allows you to make config changes through the gui menu so here there's stuff like category cooldown cooldown time debug discord integration economy filter filter submit importance message delay time minimum words rating rate resolve and templates so these are true or false values or numerical values so if you wanted to increase the um, delay time you can just left click to increase and right click to decrease it is so simple but something like this can really go a long way and of course for any changes that you decide to make you can just do mod rec reload and the config loads in a super fast fashion which is really nice and upon reloading it also gives you an update of the two open tickets plus the one flag ticket that we have open and it also lets staff members know that when they log into the server as well so yeah guys that's about going to do it for advanced mod request i really like this plugin a lot especially if you're you know a server that doesn't have a discord server or a formal website to make these sorts of requests this plugin is practically essential at that point so i'll leave a link to download this plugin down in the description below i'll also leave my server ip barbercraft down in the description below thank you so much for watching everybody and be sure to like comment and subscribe for more plugin showcase videos on that note hope you all have a great day and i'll see you guys later